What's cracking, YouTube family? It's your big homie Wayne. I'm Chrissy. Put y'all off with another one of these reaction videos. Okay, I want to make sure that we let you guys know first and foremost, Happy New Year. Year. You know what I'm saying? This is our first video of 2021. Man, we're very, very excited about yes. the end of 2020 in regards to the channel and the response that we've been getting from you guys. So it's really just energizing us for, hey, today and the rest of 2021. Just excited about the channel. You know what I'm saying? And you know, hey, we finally got the furniture and everything Ooh, all placed yes. the last few days. So we haven't been able to hit you guys off with any videos or anything like that. We just been, you know, going through the motions of getting everything put together. But I mean, I think we starting to come around because here we are back in front of the camera, back with you guys with another video. And uh, you ready for this one right here? Yes, sir. All right, so we about to get into one from Meat Canyon, man, Meat Canyon. Last year they closed it out with the uh, SpongeBob one and the Secret Formula, which went crazy. <laughs> Everybody seen that one. So this right here is his first post from his Monster Lab series of 2021. This one is called The Mortal Man, <laughs> Episode One. Let's get into it. There was a house on top of a hill where a dying scientist bequeathed his life's work to his two assistants, Cats and Uno. The scientist gave Ooh. instructions on how to create monsters solve any problem, along with a series of documents on the cure to cancer, AIDS, and world hunger. But, unfortunately, due to an untimely grease fire caused by someone cooking some fries, not naming any names, but the house was burnt down, <laughs> and the scientist's work was lost to weather. Now, with a handful of monsters and a fire insurance check, Cats and Uno have purchased a three-bedroom house and acquired some bottom town. This is their monster land. <laughs> Okay. Hello, Helga. Howard. Fine day we're having, isn't it? How's the rest bracelet? Ah, beautiful couple, those Schultzes. Relics of a better time. Unlikely. <laughs> so mysterious. So dark. I can only imagine what kind of evil lurks in that house. And a great servant you are. Why don't you unwind with a little bath from Eric? Eric? I'm gonna clean you like a cat. Uh oh. Let's craft a creature that just wants us to beat the shit out of him. I mean, really just lay into him. Well, sounds like anger management would be a more obvious choice. But yeah, I guess beating something could be the answer. Y'all need a quick cleanup before we go down. No, thank you, Eric. You're very thorough. He wanted to take care of the elderly. Oh, I'm no servant to those bulldog-faced fiends. Wait, I've got an idea. Old people usually have a ton of money, right? Yes. How else would they be able to renovate old cars and acquire so much medicine? What if we did some odd jobs for some old people? Hang some shelves, move some furniture? Easy work for a high price. Not a bad idea, you know. We do have that ugly couple next door. Maybe we pop in and see what they need. If they decide to reward us, we can get that sword to make some monsters to chop up. Now we're on the same page. Let's go see what those skin sacks need help with. Cleaving house, 12.30, baby. He's draws. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Don't you bother those beautiful old angels! Now, Uno, if he has any lawn jockeys or other racist paraphernalia, just know <laughs> he's a product of his time. I mean, I don't think that's really an excuse for blatant racist iconography, is it? Oh, you liberal little bitch. <laughs> oh, God, <laughs> Snowflake. Uno! Snowflake, my- You boys can, can help me with any problem? Well, to a moral extent, yes. My morals are very loose, so you can ask me for pretty much anything, big guy. <laughs> oh, come on in, boys. Let me on you a <laughs> tail. <laughs> This is literally the exact situation I find myself in. Uh, except for the colored fellow, of course. Hello, gentlemen. May I offer you some oh, tough wow. cookies? Damn it, Helga! The baby was... Leave us men to talk, you vile old goat! Okay, then, dear. Love you. I want to bury my face into a teenage girl's bosom again. Prowl the town for some young strange. Your excessive use of young made that all very creepy for me. Well, also, don't you love your beloved Helga and her cookies? Oh my word, Harold. You look fantastic. Wow. Did you boys help my Harold? 
We sure did. Well, here's your medal. I saw how to lift it on the counter next to different kinds of lubricants and mm-hmm. penis pills and flavored condoms. But uh, <laughs> and that doesn't concern you, boys. All right, so here we have it, man. Uh, Meat Cannon with his first episode from Monster Lab, The Immortal Man. What do you think about that one? He back at it again. With his little t- twisted, twisted cartoon. Mm. That was very interesting. Mm. Didn't go as planned. See, well, <laughs> the wife thought so. She was happy. <laughs> she was very happy. She was extremely happy with her, with her new husband. <laughs> um, me came, man, back with the good animated series. Now something new. Looking, I am looking forward to. It. I think that was pretty funny. That was pretty good. Um, and if it's gonna be the same reoccurring type of characters, I'm interested to see what he's gonna come up with in the next episode. I mean. That whole process, thinking about that skeleton going inside the god, <laughs> different. I, that was different. How I went in and changed him. And what do you guys think of it? Just in the comments, let us know. Are you guys fans of Meat Can? You guys looking forward to this Monster Lab? What you guys think of this first episode? Are you looking forward to more? Jump down in the comments and let us know how you feel about it, man. Like I said, we're just happy to be back in the new year with our new video right here, dropping it off. And we're looking forward to getting back to more of you guys' requests and suggestions. Those coming up, so make sure you guys leave them in the comment box. And make sure you guys also give this video a huge thumbs up. Does lots for sports for the channel. More people see the video just like you did. Okay, and if you have not done so, your first time talking about it, make sure to subscribe button, ring notification bell, all that good stuff. Peace. Out of there. Y'all take it easy.